God is a rewarder. He's a rewarder of those who seek him. He's a rewarder of those whose confidence is in him. And we must continue to trust him because he is present at all times. He rewards our work. God has set work as the means for us to earn a living. And so for each human being, we work somewhere and uh, we get rewarded for it. Work is not a curse. Work is a blessing. It is our means for earning a livelihood. But many times the work that we do is not directly for ourselves. We work for a company or somebody or the government. And so we put out a lot of work and we expect that the one we work for will reward us. And, and so sometimes we put out a lot of work and we wonder, do they really appreciate what I'm doing? Do they really reward me for what I am worth? And if you don't manage that expectation well, you may then uh, become hurt, become bitter, and, and stop working altogether. So I want to talk about God rewarding us and the work of our hands. Ruth was a very young widow uh, who gave up her own ambitions to work for her mother-in-law and, and to serve her and to follow her. And it seemed like a very dangerous step to take for a young lady to abandon her own desires to follow an older woman. However, Ruth got rewarded in the Bible, and her story is in the book of Ruth in the Bible. And uh, eventually, although it didn't seem likely, she met a nice young man who married her and introduced her to a new life of joy and happiness. And the reason why the man chose Ruth to marry her is in the book of Ruth, chapter 2, verse 11 and 12. The man's name is Boaz, and Boaz answered and said to her, It has been fully reported to me all that you have done for your mother-in-law since the death of your husband, and how you have left your father and your mother and the land of your birth, and have come to a people whom you did not know before. The Lord repay your work, and a full reward be given to you by the Lord God of Israel, under whose wings you have come to take refuge. Please take note of the verse 12 again. The Lord repay your work and a full reward be given to you by the Lord God of Israel. When you have this mindset that the one who really rewards you is God and he's the one who repays you, although you work for a company or you work for somebody, you don't make that the source of your reward. The Lord is your rewarder. Ruth worked for Naomi. But Naomi didn't reward her. It was God who rewarded her. So I just want to encourage you. Many times you may not think people appreciate you well and people value the contribution you are making, but your reward is the Lord. He's the rewarder of those who diligently seek him. And so I declare to you that God is your rewarder. He will reward you. He will repay you. And you have far more than you have invested in other people's lives. I am Pastor Mesa Otabel. Shalom, peace, and life to you.